Van life. RV life. Minimalism. Glorified homelessness. Whatever you want to call it, millions of people are downsizing their houses and apartments to buy back their time and freedom. This year, Oliver Tang and I, Devin Phil Green, decided to join these glorious vagabonds to trade the trappings of the Joneses and the keepings of the Kardashians for the freedom of the Gypsies. And like all great adventures, it sucked a lot before it was good, and you are gonna see all of that. Despite these setbacks though, this project has taught us carpentry, electrical, plumbing, and most of all, mental toughness. And collectively, we're saving over $3,500 every month. That translates to over 250 taxed work hours that's ours again. And we get to spend that on creative projects and gear and travel and experiences. All of these things that are statistically proven to make you happier than stuff. So buckle up and take the journey with us as we give birth to Shannon, the rowboat. Deep friendship. Deep friendship. I am the captain now. Itinerary for the day. I want to get rid of all of that terrible green carpet and replace it with a really beautiful sea blue carpet that we got. Enough talk, time to work. Ladies and gentlemen, the seats are done. So this is our rear view mirror, but it has a backwards cam as well. This guy right here. Say what's up, Patrick. What's going on? This is Patchy. What we're trying to do is poke this guy up here, turn on the engine, and then see if we can just have the backup cam running all the time instead of just in reverse. Because we have no way of seeing what is behind us. Let's see what happens. Team friendship. Team friendship. You need me to give it a little juice? This okay. dolphin's been through a lot. So we have feed from the front cam. I don't know how to switch it to the back. Oh wait, Patchy. Yo, we just figured this out. We have forever video recording from the back of the dolphin. God, you guys are geniuses. <laughs> We're just mere men. Are we men? Or are we ideas? Right. While well, Oliver's doing NASA style work, you know, you gotta clean too. Arguably the most important job. You know, you really get the dust up first so you don't get a mud effect. That's what I found. But then you can just scrub away like Cinderella. I'm a man too. Everett, ever, has anybody tell, told you you don't look like a man in your 80s? Like a woman in the 80s? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if we can get that done, that's a successful day in my opinion. Take all this stuff out. Time to eat. Go for it. That was so much easier than I thought it was gonna be. You've been saying that a lot this trip. Everything looks way harder than it is. There's some wetness in there somewhere. Is it leaking? A little bit. Okay, Jeannie, I'm gonna set the camera down. <laughs> Say what's up, Anthony. See what this takes. <laughs> what's up? 